how to solve an absolute valued function which is in modulus. In this video, I will show you step by step on how to solve this type of question and we'll start right now. Hello everyone, my name is Shirley and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here and you'd like to improve in your MS skills, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so that you don't miss out anything. Let's take a look at the first question. For question 1, given the functions fx equals to modulus x plus 6 and fx equals to 10, find the values of x. So first of all, I'm going to write down the fx given, which is fx equals to modulus x plus 6. I'm going to put this as equation 1 and then fx equals to 10 and this equation 2. Okay, so I'm going to substitute equation 1 into 2 okay so therefore we will get x plus 6 equals to 10 in order to find the values of x you have to open up the modular sign so we'll get x plus 6 equals to negative 10 or x plus 6 equals to 10 okay so we're going to solve this separately so x is equals to negative 10 minus 6 so therefore x is equals to negative 16 okay and then next so x is equals to 10 minus 6 therefore x is equals to 4 okay so we have two answers so therefore x is equals to negative 16 or 4 so this is the answer for question 2 Given the functions gx is equal to modulus 2x plus 8 and gx is equal to 12, find the values of x. So first of all, we're going to write down the two functions given, which are gx equals to modulus 2x plus 8 and gx equals to 12. I'm going to take this as equation 1 and this equation 2. Okay, and next I'm going to substitute equation 1 into equation 2 okay so we'll get modulus 2x plus 8 equals to 12 okay so in order to find the values of x we have to open up the modulus sign so we'll get 2x plus 8 equals to negative 12 or 2x plus 8 equals to 12 and then we're going to solve the values of x separately. So 2x equals to negative 12 minus 8. So 2x equals to negative 20. x equals to negative 20 over 2. And x is equals to negative 10. For this side, 2x equals to 12 minus 8. 2x equals to 4. x equals to 4 over 2 and x equals to 2. So therefore, x is equals to negative 10 or 2. So this is the final answer. For question 3, given the functions kx is equals to modulus half x minus 5 and kx is equals to 9, find the values of x. So first of all, we write down the functions given which are kx equals to modulus half x minus 5 and kx equals to 9. Okay, I'm going to take this as equation 1 and this is equation 2. And we're going to substitute equation 1 into 2. Okay, then we'll get modulus half x minus 5 equals to 9. Okay, in order to solve the values of x, we have to open up the modulus sign. So we get half x minus 5 equals to negative 9 or half x minus 5 equals to 9. Okay, so we're going to find this separately. So half x equals to negative 9 plus 5. So half x 
is equal to so negative 9 plus 5 is equal to negative 4 okay and x is equal to negative 4 multiplied by 2 so x is equal to negative 8 and for this side half x equals to 9 plus 5 so half x equals to so 9 plus 5 is 14 and then x is equal to 14 multiplied by 2 so therefore x is equal to 28 so therefore x is equal to negative 8 or 28 so this is the answer well that's all for now do you understand what you have learned in the video today let me know in the comments below if you find this video useful hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my new videos every single week thanks so much for watching and i hope you guys will keep on learning keep on practicing and keep on watching my videos and i see you guys in the next video bye